Okay, and welcome to Doris's Kitchen. And today we're making a dolphin birthday cake. A dolphin birthday cake, which is what oh, a lot of boys and a lot of kids love dolphins, especially if you've taken them uh, on some trips and everything, or they've gone on class trips and everything. Uh, I'm making this for a friend uh, who wants something. Uh, Dolphins for her birthday. Anything dolphin is what she wants for her birthday. So I told her mom, I'll do the dolphin cake. So here's my dolphin cake. And, uh, and what we did was, uh, first of all, you know me, I use whatever I happen to have around the house. So I just have my round cake pan and stuff. And so I did that and then I made my two different uh, blues my frosting and everything and then my darker blue got plenty left okay but what I did was I went on the web and I looked at a dolphin I said well okay I'll draw it of course you know the paper wasn't quite big enough so I'll have to allow for my extra there and for the extra on the tail and everything which is what I did and I tried to stay with the side if you notice this one here come off and I tried to stay with the side because then you know your frosting when you're frosting it with a, a knife and everything, it won't all stick and take the crumbs and you got crumbs of cake mixed in with your uh, frosting. So here's my little dolphin. I thought I did pretty good. Just add to more tail and more thin up there. So on the first layer, uh, because this is supposed to be the other side of the dolphin, uh, so you only leave one of uh, kind of like the legs, whatever you want to call it, the bottom thin. And for the top, of course, you have to go, um, for this side here, you have to go both layers. And when I did his, the fin, is I left the whole first layer. I gave him his whole fin for the first layer. On the second one, I sliced it in half. So I, he only got half. And then, you know, you got the roundness of the belly going on. Okay, and then as you can see, you know, it's got the light blue and then the dark blue which is what we've done here. So what we have left to do now, and his tail, I kind of left him just on one layer, but then with frosting, you know, you can work miracle with frosting and just kind of made it go up and everything because his tail is not as fat as his body and stuff. So now we just need to bring him to life. So we need to give him his eyes. So that's the only part that I have left in which to do. So we're going to go up like that, and then for around his eyes, we're kind of, kind of come out, kind of giving it almost like a diamond kind of shape. And then we're going to come back down, just on the very side along with it. There we go, and when it dries, you'll be able to just tap this down so it's not pointing out. And what we're going to do is give him his eyes is we're just going to take a little chocolate kiss, put it upside down, put it right in the center there. There we go. And we'll give him a little more blue right there. If you got a bigger uh, Hersey kiss, you can use that. This did not quite fill it, and I want to fill. Go. And there he is. There's our dolphin and everything. So you don't have to be an expert. You know, this is the first time I've ever made this one. Uh, if you check my uh, website and everything, you'll see all my cakes are first time making them. And I always use whatever I have around the house, except for the doll cake. That one there I have done before. So stay tuned for more because in... The middle of next month, one of my granddaughters is having her third birthday. So she always has a lot of people, so she is going to have something special. So I plan a very special cake for her, so if you want to see that. These are all just fun cakes that you can make for your kids. You know, you don't have to be a, uh, in the catering business and everything. Simple mom, grandma, great-grandma, 
you can do this. You know, just take your time. Line your colors in and everything. And if you find that there are too many bumps, you know, after you've uh, used your knife and everything, then you just lightly go and tap it down once it dries a little bit and stuff. So that takes, you know, a little bit. See? You get to knock that right down. Just like that. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed my bringing you this dolphin cake. So, happy birthday, April. This is for you. Bye-bye now. Giving you a nice close view picture so you can see it, you know, with the fin and everything. All of it very nicely so you can all see it. And do these special things for your kids and everything. It's the fact that you took the time uh, to make it, and that's what makes it really special. Okay? Stay tuned for more. Bye-bye.